Happy Saturday ARC players and welcome back to a brand new video. Now today we have information on the release of ARC Survival Ascended Extinction. This has actually surprised me quite a lot. I expect it to change but this is the current date we've got set for Extinction which is a bit of a surprise. It is part of obviously on the roadmap too which we'll look at um, but this is information from the devs on Extinction. If you saw my video last night, we did also get the Yeeling teaser for Aberration, which is coming September 4th. We also have a heads up on the release for the Aberration DLC as well. So I hope you guys do get all the news you need to know. If you do, if you wouldn't mind dropping a like on the video, as always, it supports me so much. And please, if you want to subscribe, come and join the, uh, the Loaded Army. I haven't used that in a long time. <laughs> it means a lot to me. So let's dive into today's video. So this was just a quick roundup summary of what we looked at last night. Um, as you can see, this was the Yeeling, which is coming to Aberration completely free. Um, and uh, some of you guys reminded me there won't be a Fantastic Tames for this because the Fantastic Tames are coming with all the um, other maps that weren't part of the storyline. Um, so Aberration will have the Cosmo coming with Bobsail Tales and then the free creature, the Yeeling, coming. Now, I'll quickly read through it just in case you haven't seen it. So... Um, they said a feathered fiend with a flair of um, for the dramatic part raptor part rogue and all its sharp edges whether you're clinging to walls dodging attacks or launching volleys of barbed feathers the yeeling is set to shake up your survival strategy with a flick of its wings it's turned the tide with, pre uh, with um, it turns the tide with precision launching razor sharp quills that really cut to the point be prepared as the yeeling arrives free with aberration on september 4th this agile assassin doesn't just wing it, it scales walls like it's climbing the pecking order. So really, really looking forward to this. I'm glad we see we saw this. And so far, it is known that we've got two creatures for Aberration, obviously one of them being paid. And just a heads up, as you can see, someone said to Dolly on the Discord saying, still on track for the fourth. And Dolly says, mm-hmm, all signs still pointing to the fourth. Now, of course, with wildcard, you, you, you always get a bit worried when they say all signs still pointing, but I do actually believe that um, it will be on time. What, you know, it might get to the fourth and then it might release on the fifth in UK time, something like that, because um, sometimes they set a time, usually like 6 p.m. UK time, and then it becomes 9 p.m. UK time, then it becomes 11 p.m. UK time, and then it becomes like two in the morning, something that happens quite a lot when they do DLC releases. But hopefully this will all be on time and we can all have a fun Wednesday because it's a Wednesday, right? September 4th. So that'll be very, very cool. Anyway, moving on, it's time to talk about Extinction. And I was very, very shocked about this. So in the Discord, someone said, no, Extinction is my favorite map. I want it so bad. And Dolly replied saying, haha, yes, we're still aiming for October at this stage, which is just crazy, isn't it? Considering, you know, when, when, when you think about it, how are they going to get these maps out in time? Like, so Aberration's coming on September 4th. Um, and then, uh, so we've then got, um, so August, how, how is this, how is this possible? Cause if we quickly go to the roadmap, um, I think it was, I always have to try and find it. It was the extra life. Um, it's even further than that. Now there it is extra life recap. Can you believe it was December, 2023? We had this and we go down to the roadmap. So, so, um, how, yeah, how it's even working is, does that mean Ragnarok's delayed? Because Aberration is July, was meant to be July 2024. It's now coming September. Ragnarok was meant to be coming September 2024. And October was meant to be the October um, um, extinction release in October. But how is that going to be possible when are they going to, because how are they going to drop Ragnarok on the same month? They must be delaying Ragnarok if they're planning on releasing extinction still in October. Very interesting. But anyway. Something else is the Bob's Tool Tales content was planned for Q1 2025 for Extinction, which is called Wasteland War. They say, fuel up your war rigs and fight to rule the desolate wastes of Extinction. Prepare for high octane automobile action as you clash with rival tribes and scavenge for survival in this post um, ap apocalyptic wasteland. So, Something is just not seeming right with these releases when it comes to the roadmap because if Extinction is actually coming in October, it has to mean a delay for Ragnarok. I have no idea. Unless they've really, really put on the gears to get these maps out as fast as possible, I have no idea. 
Obviously, November will be the Ark Survival Ascended surprise because we'll have that extra life, hopefully with some Ark 2 stuff as well. But maybe they really are. I just can't see it. I just don't know. But as of the wording, we're still aiming, you know, clearly could mean a delay there. So that is currently what we've been told from the devs. Apparently, Extinction is coming at that point. But yeah, we will just sit and wait and see what happens. So also in the rest of the community crunch, um, there was some new um, cross-platform mod spotlights. We had the house grounder outfit, the goblin costume, the medieval swords, medieval pikes, um, the Noglin uh, cosmetics, spino costume skin, um, the death worm update for no untamables, the tech war map, scrapped assets, um, um, cottages, and lots more and then they have the um the arc apocalypse servers are getting a modded makeover so for the first round the following mods will be included the marnie mods hairstyles the arcomatic the sunken world additions the tristan's um uh, uh, additional creatures um upgrade station mis mystery crates cliffens backpacks and utilities plus and this will all be beginning on august 16th so six days time until this will be happening now we have bonus rates that have just gone live right now. Um, so from Friday until Monday, we will have times two on the official network. Um, and then obviously until, so you've, another, you've got another two days of the Summer Olympics colors for the Wild Creature colors, which is light yellow, dino deep blue, actual black, vermilion, jade, dino albino, red, blue, dragon base one, light warm gray, and peach. So yeah that's pretty much everything that's going on with the world of arc um as i said the yearling the creature that's coming to someone asked me this the other day the creature that will be coming to extinction is the dread nautus um so if we we i don't know how far we have to go back for this but it was around this time so there's the shastasaurus um when they did the concept art of it and everything like that then this was the yearling I think that did the Dread Nautas come before or after that? I, I remember it was somewhere around. Maybe it was before. Um, I'm not too sure. We'll have to. Did, did I miss it? A page? What was it? So this is when it. Oh, here it is. I did. You guys probably saw it. And we're like, Dom, you just skipped past it. So this is the Dread Nautas. Um, as you can see, you will feel the earthquake as the. Um, you will feel the earthquake as the. Uh, titanic dread nautus makes its way to extinction this behemoth is short to shake up some strategies and make your enemies tremble in fear as we gear up for the release of arc survival ascended our friends at the official arc wiki are also working at some oh, yeah, anyway so we're looking forward to the week ahead it's going to be a fun one and this is the community creation of the dread nautus and when you realize the size of this thing, look at the survivor down here and then look at the size. This Dread Nautas is meant to be similar sort of sizes to the Titans. Um, so this will be really exciting. I mean, when I think about it, it's like, are they gonna, how are they going to get this already? I mean, I want this to be the case because I hate these long, boring, like sort of months where nothing new's going on with Ark. Like this month of August is going to be a pretty quiet one. Obviously, it's mainly just going to be the build up to aberration. But then if within the next couple of months we're going to have extinction where's ragnarok coming and then um and uh, aberration i it just doesn't make sense but i guess we'll just see what happens um i would take it with a pinch of salt that release date at this moment in time we'll see what happens but anyway guys that is going to be your full news update today i hope you guys did enjoy and i hope you have a fantastic rest of your weekend i will see you guys tomorrow make sure to leave a like subscribe and thank you for watching